What's going on, guys? So today's video, we are gonna review uh, a product uh, that I have been toying with for a little bit. Um, it is called a Renfo Smart Scale. So it's a scale. Um, now, I'm not a big proponent for scales. I don't like uh, people oh, the overuse that people engage in with scales. Uh, so I talk to a lot of my clients about that. I have to have conversations stepping on the scale because it they end up becoming obsessed with numbers, with the numbers on the scale. So that is my problem with scales generally. And um, I don't, I don't step on a, I do not step on a scale regularly. I don't. I check my, I use my body fat, my measurements, and just my vision. I just look at my body. I see how it feels, how it's moving, and am I getting the uh, physique that I want? Is it performing the way that I, the way I want it to? And then I feel it in my clothes. So I'll say that to my clients a lot to focus on those things, so that they're not consistently obsessed with the number. Especially if you're trying to build uh, muscle mass and you know athletic fitness and stuff like that, then the scale doesn't really help. I mean, maybe it, if you're trying to lose. Um, lots of pounds 50 60 80 pounds you know then yeah scales is important but even then I tell them maybe a, a couple weeks or once a week or something like that so 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 again I am NOT a huge fan of uh, scales or and even if I do have a scale around I don't need it to be a super fancy scale that said um, I have purchased some pretty expensive scales over the years um, I have a digital scale that I got it like a Bed Bath Me On or linens and things or anything. One of those scales, and it was supposed to do all the body fat things, and it was a very nice scale, and we used it for my fighters because and, and uh, martial arts competitors because you know we have to make weight and stuff like that. Uh, so we needed a very accurate scale, uh, and those scales run for like sixty dollars to get a really good digital scale. Um, I, I'm sure there's more there's some more affordable options that don't have all the bells and whistles, but the one I have in my office right now is was about sixty dollars. Um, now the alternative also what we use or the other thing we use is like a doctor scale That's the one that has like the sliding um, uh, Weight on it um, and those tend to be you know are considered to be more accurate And that's why doctors use them in a doctor's offices I do have one of those and I lucked out and found that scale in like a, a goodwill store I uh, one of those secondhand stores and I got it for a steal I think I paid $40 for it now amazingly those scales those types of scales are upwards of hundreds of dollars. Um, so those are very expensive as well. This brings me to the Renfo, R-E-N-P-H-O. Um, let's splash a picture of it right here. Okay, now I was sent this scale uh, to try out and I was very, very impressed with it. Now, what I'm most impressed with is the price. This scale right now retails on Amazon for $32.99, so $33. So what do you get for $33? Is it worth it? It is absolutely worth it, okay? And I'm gonna show you why. Um, it comes with an app and it tracks everything. So let me show you the app real quick. So we have my data and my wife's data saved in here, which is pretty cool. So we're gonna click into my data and then you're gonna see my weight and body fat percentage. Uh, and then if you scroll down, you're going to see all the cool things that the scale will show you through this app. I mean, more than just pounds, you've got your body fat percentage, skeletal muscle, muscle mass, uh, you know, body water, uh, BMI, um, BMI, BMR, and your metabolic age. Uh, here is where you set what your goal is, uh, and it shows you where you are against your goal. From there, there's a tab that you click that can give you uh, graphs to track your progress um, for your weight, for your body fat. Uh, again, all the um, things that it tracks, it can give you these graphs to show you your progress, which is another really neat feature. And you can really start to uh, see how you're doing and you can check by day, week, or even month. I mean, just look at all the information that's at your fingertips, and this is some pretty cool stuff that I've never been able to get from a scale before. And again, you can put multiple users um, into the app, which is another cool feature. Now, having a scale that's matched with the app is not a new thing, but I have this is my first experience with it. And I have to say that this thing is very, very accurate. I'm very impressed with it. Um, and the type of information it can give you um, as I covered with, when I showed you the app, is, is so amazing. And for $33, when I've paid $60, $40 for scales that don't even do any of that, or they're supposed to, like the $60 scale I have right now is supposed to be able to give me those numbers, but 
It really doesn't. It doesn't work all the time. Now, as far as the accuracy of the body fat percentages and all that stuff, um, I tend to measure my clients with one of those handheld body fat measures. And again, that is not the most accurate measurement, but you know, if we're, we're getting close, okay? And you use the tools that you have. Obviously, if you wanna go get someone to do like a seven point pinch or something, get a very accurate body fat, by all means. But these will work. Now, using the handheld Omni um, body fat uh, calculator, right? Using that and then matching it up against the results that I had uh, from the Rinfo smart scale, it was within like half a percent or one percent or within half a percent. So it, it's there, it's, it's very, ac it's, it's, I wouldn't say very accurate, it's pretty accurate. You know, I don't know if, if it's super accurate, but it's close enough, it's what I need. It's, it's what my clients need, okay? It's what the average person needs. One little, one little piece of advice, when I first got the scale, I thought it was broken because every time I stepped on it, it wasn't calculating my body fat and all that stuff and I was getting impatient. Um, so what, what you have to do is you have to stand on the scale after the weight pops up, I was immediately stepping off the scale. I didn't realize I needed to stand on it longer. So you stand on the scale, weight pops up, stay there a little longer and you're gonna see these four circles go across. Wait till that goes through, then it, pop, it flashes your weight again. Now all your information is, is calculated and it's shot to the app, okay? All right, uh, you probably already guessed, but my final verdict is this product is awesome, especially for the price. For the price, you are getting a quality product um, that I think you should definitely uh, consider. Uh, if you are trying to lose weight, if you're an athlete, for whatever reason that you end up stepping on a scale, this thing is awesome. Um, and it can also, again, if you, as you saw in the app, it can track your progress and you know you can set goals and stuff like that. I want you to be uh, weary of, or wary of becoming obsessed with the scale though. That is always my advice. Like do not step on the scale every day. I just, it's just something you should not do. Um, it, you do not become obsessed with the number on the scale uh, because it's not a good measurement of your progress uh, if you're looking for athleticism, fitness, and all those different things. And it could drive you nuts and it could make you become obsessive. So that's just my little spiel on my feelings about people who become obsessed with stepping on the scale. So be very careful about that. But as far as having a skill, you do need one. You want to know where you stand uh, if you're stepping on it periodically. Um, and then again, if you're tracking yourself for athletic means, you want to know these numbers. You want to know uh, bone mass and, and body fat and BMI and all these. Well, not BMI, um, but you know, uh, your muscle versus subcutaneous fat and visceral fat. And the fact that this thing can give me that information is amazing. And for $33 on Amazon. It is on Amazon for $32.99 right now. I'm gonna put the link in the comments uh, in the, the description below, okay guys? Man, so if you're looking for a good scale at an affordable price, this is the one, the Renfro Smart Scale. So check it out, guys. As always, keep fighting for fit, no excuses. And I'll see you guys in the next video.